Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 545, Diaphragm Structures. What structure perforates the diaphragm at the level of T8? At the level of T8, the diaphragm is perforated by the inferior vena cava. What structures perforate the diaphragm at the level of T10? At the level of T10, the vagus nerve and esophagus are what perforates the diaphragm. What perforates the diaphragm at the level of T12? At the level of T12, the diaphragm is perforated by the aorta, thoracic duct, and the azygos vein. What is the mnemonic to help you remember that these three things are what perforates the diaphragm at the level of T12? To help you remember this, just remember the rhyme at T12, it's red, white, and blue. Red for the aorta, white for the thoracic duct, and blue for the azygos vein. What is the mnemonic to help you remember these different structures perforating the diaphragm? The mnemonic is to remember the number of letters at T level. So therefore T8 is vena cava and that contains 8 letters. T10 is the esophagus which contains 10 letters. And T12 is the aortic hiatus which is 12 letters. Another mnemonic is to remember I ate 10 eggs at 12. I is for inferior vena cava, 8 is for the number 8 because of the T8 level, 10 is the T10 level, egg is for esophagus, at is for aorta, and 12 is for the T12 level. What nerve innervates this involuntary muscle, the diaphragm? Diaphragm is innervated by the phrenic nerve which comes off of C3, C4, C5. Describe how pain from diaphragm is referred. Pain from the diaphragm is referred to the shoulder via C5 and to the trapezius ridges via C3 and C4. What is the mnemonic to help you remember that the diaphragm is innervated by these cervical nerves? The mnemonic is to remember C3, C4, C5 keeps the diaphragm alive. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.